Hello, welcome back to X++ programming language. In this video, we'll talk about a string concatenation. So if you don't know what is a string concatenation, so first we will define that what is a string concatenation and I'll show you two different process how you can concatenate your string and then we'll move to the practical example and I'll show you the code by which you can con concatenate your string. So let's start. String concatenation is the process of combining or joining two or more strings to create a new string. It's a common operation in every programming language when you want to build longer strings by appending or combining smaller string then we actually call it as a string concatenation in x++ programming language also in c sub programming language you can use the plus operator to concatenate a string so now i'll jump into the practical session and i and i'll show you how you can concatenate so in this code you can see that we have a runnable class concatenation class and to concatenate we need two different string at least we need two different string so for that we'll to take two string variable first name and last name now you can see that we have declared the first name as a roman and last name is ansari so we want to concatenate it using the plus operator so for that you have to write like that you have to declare one another variable full name and there you can use the first name and then you have to use the plus operator and to give the space in between the first name and last name you can uh, give the double quote and after that again to concatenate what another variable you have to specify the last name here now if you want to print it then you have to use the info method and inside this you can um, pass your variable full name and after that you have to give the semicolon and to see the result you have to make it as a start of object and after that you have to uh, start uh, this button to execute this program okay so first we will run and we will see the result now you can see that our program executed and you can see the result here room one then you can see the space here and answer it so this way you can concatenate now i'll show you to one more different process so for that i'll cross it and i'll stop the execution process so to if you have a multiple variable and if you want to add that one also so again you have to give the plus sign here and uh, you, you can give the you, you have to give the plus sign here and again you have to give the space and you using the plus button then you have to name, give the name of the variable but at this point of time we want to concatenate only two variable so this way you can actually concatenate uh, but if you want to concatenate the string directly how you can do that so to concatenate to string directly you can use like this you have to like you use like this and there we have to mention you have to give the quotation here and directly you can give your string here also for the last name you can also copy that directly and you can paste your string directly here also so this way also you can concatenate your string if you don't want variable concatenation then you can use directly this one so again i'll show you another process using the plus equal operator so for example you have only this first name okay and you want to concatenate with this first name with another string so how will do that so for that one just you have to use the plus button here you have to use the plus button here and equal button and after that if you want to concatenate first name with the last name then you can use like this way so it will concatenate the full name and answer it. so why it is giving error because the full name is already mentioned here that is why you can see the problem here so if you'll so you can see that why it is giving error because the full name is already declared here 
so if you want to concatenate the string which is already present so that's why you have to remove this str uh, data type here and now we can see that we can concatenate uh, the answer with the full name so what will be the result of the full name now uh, using this using this line you can see that the full name here here is roman and then it will give a space answer -y. and if we'll concatenate again with the full name with answer -y, then uh, what it will do it will uh, add this particular string with this particular full name so the final result will be roman space answer -y, and then it will give the space from here and then it will add the answer -y also so if we'll execute it it will show room one answer and answer -y. so just click the run button to see the result so now you can see that our program executed and you can see the result room one answer -y and answer -y because we have concatenate last using the plus equal operator okay i hope you understood the concept of string concatenation so to concatenate a string the plus operator or plus equal operator are used to concatenate a uh, concatenate string in both x plus plus and c sharp programming language okay so thanks for watching this video see you in the next one till then take care bye bye